guys, welcome back to another video. So today I am going to be comparing the large Longchamp Le Playage Tote to the medium Longchamp Le Playage Tote. And the reason why I've decided to film this video is because I have had so many questions lately as to what fits in each one, which is the better size. So I have the large tote in black, both have the shoulder straps, and then I have the medium tote in the paper color, which I absolutely love. So the bags are made from a polyamide canvas with an inside coating. That's just what I've taken from the website. You also have Russian cowhide leather trimming which is really beautiful and soft um, and very comfortable on the body. You have a beautiful gold tone hardware as you can see there if it will focus for me. This is a new lens guys and it's still getting used to me. The weight of the medium sized tote is 220 grams and then the weight of the large size tote is 290 grams. So if you didn't already know these bags actually fold down so they're great for travel and then you do have a complete zip closure and then on the inside you'd have two pockets one is smaller than the other and inside these bags I like to use organizers so for the medium size I use a speedy 30 organizer I will link this below because this fits like a glove like it's literally the same dimensions as the speedy 30 and then as for the large size I use the Louis Vuitton Neverfull MM size organizer so they fit great they help to keep the bag in shape um, they also help to keep everything organized in there because they can become quite a bottomless pit because they are quite large bags. I'll quickly run through the prices of these bags. The large tote retails for 285 Australian dollars, 155 US dollars and 115 pounds. And the medium sized tote retails for 265 Australian dollars, 140 US dollars and 105 pounds. So there's not a huge difference in price. So don't think about the price when you're looking at which one to purchase. Just think about your lifestyle in which one is going to suit you best. So now I'm going to share with you what fits inside each bag and hopefully that will answer a lot of your questions. I wanted to preface before the video, I don't show a laptop going inside the medium sized tote. It does fit, a 13 inch laptop does fit in here. However, it doesn't fit beautifully along the bottom because the 13 inch laptop is just a little bit longer. However, if you were to take the organizer out of the bag and you would just use it like this, just use it freely, you will be able to fit a 13 inch laptop. So although I don't show it in this video I just wanted to let you guys know that both bags fit a laptop but if you are someone that carries a laptop majority of the time then I would probably recommend the large size just because it fits a lot nicer and it's almost made for it whereas with the medium size you can fit it in but it just doesn't sit as nicely so here we have the medium size I'm just going to put in here what I would generally carry for a work day so again I have my organizer in there so without the organizer there are some additional items that will fit but I'll share them with you as we go along so we have my a5 planner, my water bottle, my mobile phone, some additional pens for my planner, my card holder, my car keys, my sunglasses. I then have the small Longchamp pouch with a top handle which I use as a catch-all in my bag. In here I like to keep hand cream, a reusable bag, my airpods, some hand sanitizer, some chewing gum, some perfume, a lip balm, some peppermint tea and a charging cord. So that will pretty much fill the bag. Now unfortunately with this water bottle in here, you can shut the bag, but it doesn't happen easily. I do have to kind of move it around, but it will close. However, if you were to take out the water bottle, it creates a lot more space and you can fit additional items. So if I did want to carry an iPad, I can slide it in the back there and I could probably still fit a small water bottle in there if I needed to. But that is the bag completely full. Now moving on to the large size, I'm going to transfer everything in here and add some additional items. So again, we have my A5 planner, we have my water bottle, we have my phone, my sunglasses, my card holder, my keys, some additional pens, my catch-all pouch, and instead of my iPad, we have the 13-inch MacBook Pro. And when it comes to closing this bag with the water bottle standing upright and the laptop, it closes very, very easily. So that's everything that fits inside the bags. Now I wanted to share with you which is my favorite and the one that I reach for most. And I would have to say the large size. And as you could see from the video, all of my belongings, my laptop, my water bottle, 
fit just a lot nicer in the large size so I just tend to reach for it a lot more. I do think the large size is quite big when you're wearing it but it looks quite cool. I like the slouchy vibe to it and I don't mind a really large tote. So anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any more questions please just leave them in the comments below. If you liked it please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It helps me out more than you know and I'll catch you all in my next one. Bye guys.